Yeah, shit, we'll save on you. If you load a save, all. Oh, that's cool. I like that little detail. Having the original. The original uh, memory card there. I like that. <laughs> kind of reminds me of the stupid way you save PlayStation 1 games on the PlayStation 3. You have to make a fake memory card. I wanted to save! Damn it! I'm a fool! At least there's the autosave. Thank God! That's the reason I don't like those. Do you, are you sure that you want to save? Because it's hard to tell sometimes. It's like. <laughs> I'm not your dad. Who are you? I don't know how to pronounce that name. Zimic? Zimic? Perhaps. But yeah. I don't. That's why I don't like the game thingy thingies going like, Are you sure that you want to save or load? I'm doing good, Ninja Penguin. Auto save saved my life because I, my brain, can't handle like these things. Like this is the exact same thing. It's like it has the same image for like, would you like to load or would you like to save? So I accidentally loaded because I thought I was saving my brain today. That is my brain today. <laughs> Also, they have a hilarious hint on the first boss, which really would have helped my younger self when I played this game. Uh, or not this game specifically, but the first original Crash Bandicoot uh, years ago. Body blows do not affect the first boss, by the way. Something my younger self should have known. Also, these boxes are highly elusive. This is not like uh, Spyro at all. This game is cryptic. This game is really one of those games like, you want to earn victory? Well, you're definitely gonna get, 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 get the damn earn it. Or else you're gonna lose. Well, not lose, you're just gonna get the normal ending, which is losing in so many people's opinions. This is definitely, what the hell? Hello, Igor, what the hell are you doing here? Damn it, the perspective hurts my brain. But this is definitely one of those, uh, one of those games that is probably gonna be on, uh, Let's see how much we can do kind of streams like beat the game normally then go have it on like let's do 100% streams of this because this seems like a difficult game not at all uh, like more skill and uh, challenging than say Spyro but I really love Spyro and I can't wait can't stick it wait no 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 stupid Mayan donuts hey there Kaka, I Kaka, my brain. I'm sorry. Right now, my brain is being stupid, and I'm already having trouble with normal things. So, trying to read Twitch names with uh, the small Twitch font and weird Twitch colors ain't messing. It ain't going for my brain. Like, funnily enough, I can't wait for this to come out on Switch, and like, uh, I'm not gonna get it immediately. It's one of those games that'd be like, this is going on my wish list for Switch. Because any game that comes out on the Switch that I really, really like, I'm probably gonna buy again on the Switch because I'm a Marine. It's probably gonna be the same. <laughs> That's the hilarious thing. This actually ties back to, uh, to something I was... Stupid pits! How dare you! You make me look bad! But it actually uh, ties into something that I was... Uh, Talking about the Spyro remastered that's coming later this year. I uh, can't wait for the. Uh, oh, this is gonna suck. Oh, hi, nice. But dang it, I've only played a little bit of the first game, but never any of the others. So, like playing the rest of this game and the other games is really gonna be interesting. But one thing that I cannot wait for is. The Spyro Trilogy, which is funny because I'm probably going to end up buying it when it comes out on the PlayStation 4 and then end up buying it on the Switch when it inevitably comes out for that too. Because honestly, with the Crash Bandicoot Trilogy coming to uh, the Switch, I forget exactly when, it just seems so fitting for it to come to Switch. 
Yeah, I just like I love Spyro. Spyro is one of my favorite game series of all time. It's one of those few games that even as a child, as a Nintendo child, I'm just like, wow, this stuck with me. Granted, it was the uh, Legend of Spyro and uh, only a Legend of Spyro commercial. Dang it! How dare you, you stupid stinky creature! But honestly, I just can't wait. I just cannot wait. And also, I'm a terrible spender, so me being like, I'm gonna buy Spyro on PlayStation 4 first, and then on Switch when it comes out inevitably there too, is me being silly, but at the same time, that's what I'm probably gonna end up doing. Yeesh. I'm gonna let that life stand there, because I am not risking anything. Bye-bye. And bye-bye to you too. Getting kidnapped. Yep. No, no, no! Do not slip off the thingy again! Uh-oh! How dare you! What? No! The alert went off, but I didn't see anything. Damn you, Streamlabs! I think it's Streamlabs that I'm using. My brain isn't failing me there, I think. But that's a super weird. Ah oh, no, I missed an Igor. Oh no. Yeah, that's so weird. Alerts not going off when they're supposed to be alerting me of alerts. This is terrible. And I tested it before 10 too. Obviously, it is a trick. Oh, that is a lot of boxes. I think I know where I missed them too. God dang it. This is definitely going to be a 100% stream game. Punish! Shame! Shame on missing all of the boxes! <laughs> yeah, poor Bandicoot suffering my mistakes. Well, suffering for my mistakes, more like. Hmm. But it, may, it really makes you wonder, though. If the remaster trilogies will lead to anything. Like if they'll go and make new Spyro games and new Crash Bandicoot games. Especially considering that the uh, Crash game, uh, Crash Insane Trilogy, apparently did really well in like Europe. To the point that I think scalpers were buying up European copies for, uh, of, of Crash Bandicoot. And because people just wanted it so much. Honestly, I wouldn't mind. Granted, though, it would be really take specific designers and such to actually do a really good job with uh, getting the same kind of feel that these games have. No, 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 no! No, Shield Man! Shield Man, no, no! You already get me trouble before! In the other level that you were in! What the hell? Oh. He knocked me off my pig and I thought I jumped off him. <laughs> my brain is, is not catching up on details. Super fast. Wow. <laughs> oh, that just reminds me of 88. What is it? 88. Oh, I forget it. It's that silly web cartoon that's just like, No, son, don't touch that cactus. Ah. God dang it. Why couldn't you move the bed, the drum just a little bit down? Nelson, don't touch that cactus. You're dead to me. <laughs> Shield man is bothering me no more. Oh no, second checkpoint. What in the world? It is chaos. Bowl. Oh, that's kind of creepy. Uh, Dostal! They tricked me. Mind games. Yeah, ASDF. My brain. My, my brain today is just not working. I don't know why. Jump here. Don't jump at the next one. Thank you, brain. You remember things at the very least. I guess I hit the wheel. Okay. Oh, 
Also, really good music. How am I supposed to say? It's, uh, auto... <laughs> I find it funny. This is actually kind of like an auto-scroller, but for 3D platformers. Ah, oh, crap, I did it again! It's habit. It's like, I see an obstacle, it's just like, obviously I must jump. It's a reflex. That shouldn't be a reflex, but for whatever reason, it's like, now you flinch. But I am in that danger. Who cares? Flinch. So I guess my memory isn't doing that as well as I thought it was. What? 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 I guess I jumped too early and it just kind of like magnetized for animation purposes. But still, have the hitboxes like uh, be like have the wonky animation. Be like, oh, even though uh, like have it be just so I know like where exactly did the hitboxes meet? Where can I avoid in the future? Don't magnetize things and make it weird. What? <laughs> learn if it doesn't actually play the proper animations for my brain how dare you it hurts me more than it hurts you because you are an inanimate object game I'm gonna try and focus on this it hurts my brain so much because I feel like I'm jumping at the appropriate part then again, they could be the perspective thing again, because I swear, there's some parts that my brain just like, in a split second, was just like, okay, this makes sense, when it really didn't. But I don't know, it's because this is a perpetual motion, I think it might be playing more tricks on my brain than I'm used to. And I did it again! <laughs> it's like, automatically! I think it's because the perspective alongside it being kind of up. God dang it! Why do I suck so much at this one part? Meh. Alright. Wait a split second longer. Go now! There we go. And if I die again, I'm gonna get angry. Yay. Funny how the only times that I get the clear crystals is on the auto levels, technically. Like the Rolling Stone and now this one. All the other ones is because the boxes elude me. You have to jump. You have to search. You have to look. You have to actually use your brain. And my brain apparently isn't in tip-top condition today. Hurts my soul. Then again, neither is Streamlabs. It's like, we're not going to actually show your alerts. How dare you. Want old school controls? Try to directional buttons. Don't you patronize me. I know they exist. Some games don't even use them anymore. That's hilarious. Boing, 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 boing. Bike. Bubba-doo. Bubba-doo. Hey, how dare you? I held the button. You know I did. How dare you? Or hold. Hmm. It's a slight little thingy. Aha! You're not gonna trick me this time, tortoise. Give me my aku aku, and then you can die. I will take my mask, and then you will die. And kill a monkey on your way. Be gone. Woo! Slip and slide. Because vegetation. <laughs> That didn't look like it should reach me when I jump, but okie doke. I will accept my failures as a platform in person. My ah, crab. Meh. My brain. Remember, kids, use your brain often, or else it will rot and you won't be able to use it anymore. And in the few times where you think you won't have to use your brain anymore, you actually will, and people will mock you for it on the internet. Oh, yeah. I forgot those are actually platforms. I just see them as hazards, and I'm like, oh, I can make that jump. You probably could, but... Did not expect them to be bouncy. Be gone. Stop. Bounce. Stupid monkey, you make me look bad. Be gone. Ah! My brain. 
I always think that you should be able to, I'm so, mm, I don't know why. My brain's telling me, you can attack faster. No, you can't. Cooldown is a thing. Okay, see one thing, my brain. Need to actually learn the specifics. Learn the control. Learn to understand the game. Become one with it, so that it can conquer your life and file your taxes for you. I pressed the jump button, didn't I? I swear I did. I could swear. But the game says no, and apparently the game is uh, all-knowing. It knows what happened. It's the game. And that's why glitches don't exist. Remember to jump. Ah, crap. It's this dude again. What? What, what? What, what? I stood on... What the hell? <laughs> Mr. Shield Afro Man. Man. My brain is not in this at all. I swear. I swear, though. It's like the shield man was not functioning properly. Like my brain. I was standing on his head. I didn't bounce like I was supposed to. And then another time when I actually landed on his head again. Then he did a late animation. I did it again. The bastard. Cheat. Cheat. Doodles.